it might seem that efforts of conserving the Mao forest have taken a back seat in light of the heated political temperature over the fate of post-election violence. But the tough-talking environment minister John Mishuki is not about to let go. The government may sue anybody seeking to stop its efforts to reforest and conserve the Mao forest. We must take quick action, even if we have to lose politically. The conservation of Mao forest has been dogged by a lot of controversy. Politicians have been split on what action to take. MPs notably from the surrounding constituencies have made it a political cry that any attempt to remove the squatters is an affront to their people. There are laws to govern situations such as Mao. In the meantime, 12 rivers have dried up and more are threatened, including the Mara River, where one of the spectacles occurs, the annual migration of the wildebeests. At the same time, Mishuki has maintained his stand on the directive on noise pollution. We shall not agree to the Honorable Minister curtailing our freedom of worship by calling our singing and our worship noise making. We are praising the Lord. And preach to your people that follow you. Don't preach at large. The government in May gazetted public noise making as a criminal offense liable to a fine of up to 350,000 shillings or 18 months in jail. Olivia Ketch, Citizen TV.